Hi fairy scribers! Today we're going to be talking about the book Ugly Love and I'm going to do a book review. My initial reaction going into the book Ugly Love by Colleen Hoover was that I needed to figure out what type of story I was going to be reading. I'd heard so many things about Colleen Hoover and the type of story she writes and just how she is really in it for the clout and she's has a good marketing team. Like people don't really see that she's a good author. But I read the book It Ends With Us by Colleen Hoover and though I hated the ending, the story itself and the way she wrote it was really good. And honestly, I like this book as far as the ending better than It Ends With Us. It Ends With Us struck me on a deeper level, but Ugly Love gave me a happy ending. And I feel like that's kind of key in a romance book. So I really appreciate that. Um, I feel like it wasn't false advertising. Like it says, hearts get infiltrated, promises get broken, rules get shattered, love gets ugly. And that is exactly what happens in this book. I didn't trust it when I saw it because in the other book, it ends with us, they make it seem like it's going to be this cute little romance and in truth, it was so much darker than that. So I went into this book thinking that it was going to be very misleading, but it was very upfront about the intentions. The intentions just shut, just sucked. So it was like a slow burn kind of, it was a crazy slow burn and I was not sure what was going on in the male interest mind, which made things really hard. But there were a few tropes that stood out to me. One of them was friends with benefits. The only thing was, is in this story, they weren't really friends to begin with. And because of that, they thought it would be safer to pursue this type of situation because like there were no losses if it didn't work out and so that was like the most toxic way to start it and I remember him saying like I have two rules don't expect a future and never ask about my past which brings us to our second trope which is secrets the main um male interest he has the secret this deep brooding secret and in the story they'll go like between present and past and in the past they're talking about like his past and like how things end badly and he just won't tell the girl that he's you know um with at the time and it's like creating a bigger wedge and so she really can't get to know him because he's like just not giving any information. Another trope that I see a lot in the story is sworn off love and or to commitment. He's sworn off love because he keeps telling one of the characters of the story that like he can't love you, he'll never be able to love you type of thing. Like it's just never gonna happen. Allergic to commitment because he doesn't want to put a name on what they're doing and he hasn't been in a relationship in like six years and honestly he's just like the biggest red flag extremely toxic relationship the worst part about this is because they're friends with benefits he is so quick to dismiss her and so quick to say that it won't work and he's just breaking her heart over and over again because the main character indeed does fall in love with him and she's so down bad that my heart breaks for her each time she just gets rejected emotionally just so sad if you've made it this far thank you so much for watching i really appreciate it please give this video a like comment and subscribe and if you like this book or have any books by colin hoover that you would recommend comment down below